we will go very fast first peter sorry second peter 1:10 colossians 4:17 ephesians 4:1 therefore brethren be even more diligent to make your call and election sure for if you do these things you will never stumble therefore brethren it's for every believer every brethren brethren include sistren therefore brethren if you read the whole chapter it would be beautiful how to add christian characters virtues kindness self control faith goodness he is writing about all the development and words 3 2 3 grace and peace be multiplied to you grace is multiplied to you peace peace is multiplied to you uh, in the knowledge of god uh, and of jesus our lord only by knowing who god is your grace multiplies peace multiplies not by your prayer by knowing things in other words revelation releases the multiplication of grace and peace next word so many of us are praying stop praying and start knowing the word and the truth ah uh, next word as his divine power has given to us all things that pertain to life and godliness it's all you know it everything you need to fulfill your calling in this world and the heavenly calling all the power is already given when god entered in your life next word through the knowledge, knowledge of, of him who uh, called us by glory and virtue everybody say he called me he called me by his glory by his glory by his virtue by his virtue if he has called me if he has called me it means it means he has supplied me he has supplied me all things all things i need to fulfill my calling i need to fulfill my calling settle this amen settle this calling is a package brother shout it my calling my calling is a package from heaven is a package from heaven all the grace i need all the grace i all need all the energy i need all the energy i need all the people cooperation i need all the people cooperation i need everything i need everything i need to fulfill my calling to fulfill my calling is, is included included in my calling in my calling Please understand calling is a package. When you buy a car, everything is there. Yeah? When you buy a computer, everything is there. So, in your calling, you know the devil has told you you are called but you don't have grace. Lie. Always the Bible says his callings according to his grace. calling is nothing but his grace let bracelet ladies have bracelet you know what's that called men have it eh? Bra- bracelet so when you are called the grace let came amen you have so much in you one person called one one called one only one person who is called by god and who knows his whole privileges and responsibilities he has so much power to destroy all the jezebel in the land one elijah one elisha the bald headed man one At that time he killed all the witch doctor ta 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 that's the calling package pakaharashika the devil has hidden it from you 
you say i am call that's why jezebel 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 is attacking me jezebel is attacking me it's the lie of the devil when you received calling you have so much power to pull down jezebel and stamp on her dead body pakas kaka para lara pakatara bashika tara lara tara bashika makatara lekotora balba karala please believe me please believe me i'm not even talking about new covenant caller called ones apostles sir much more than elijah or elisha you don't know that the devil has hid it from us one jona one jona not even like our character we want we pray lord save india he prayed lord destroy nineve he fasted and prayed the whole nation must die but one thing he operated in his calling of course of course he went through a lot we will come afterwards <laughs> there are many jonas here the lord showed me this morning you joke joke so what happened with that problem he became you know he is a jewish man he became completely white he became american the fish as it changed his whole color <laughs> from head to wood bilkul white three days as it was some people are here already as it was <laughs> otherwise do you think this apostle will come here for 21 days <laughs> even after backsliding no passion the only passion is he is he built there small tent after prophecy you know he could have gone home he didn't want to go he built there tent sitting my prophecy must fulfill <laughs> watching every day 39 days ha <laughs> everything will burn ha <laughs> ha that person when he stepped into the calling not stepped forced into the calling <laughs> some people easily step some people are forced into the calling after acid wash <laughs> thank god you came alive pakra katriya sheka hatora bashika he is watching what would happen to ninivenga can you imagine how good we are how great we are is watching what would happen then god took so much time to convince this one fellow to change the whole ninive very short work to change the called person papa years and years convincing convincing he grew a plant plant for one person to convince this called people actually beloved the problem is not with ninive the problem is with jonas please listen it's god's voice one jona with all the acid wash three days inside the fish forced vomited him <laughs> prophet apostle vomited by the fish that person 
three days journey he started one day nga one day the whole nineve started fasting that's the power of your calling pakatara sakatara you don't know it you don't know who you are you don't know what you have pakatari ara para pakatara sikha bahat para bashto tora bana 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 Please understand, everybody say, Father, Father, let me know, let me know, the strength of my calling, the strength of my calling, the power of my calling, power of my calling, devil, devil, I resist you, I resist you, don't blind my eyes, don't blind my eyes, you focus on my weak side, you focus on my weak side. You never allow me to see what I have. You never allow me to see what I have. My calling. My calling. Is a package. Is a package. I have all the grace. I have all the grace. I have all the power. I have all the power. I have all the authority. I have all the authority. And dominion. And dominion. To fulfill my calling. To fulfill my calling. Blamelessly. Blamelessly. And completely. And completely. Papa Tiru. Arakani ala. He called you by His glory, by His virtue, by His virtue mean on His merit basis, not on your merit basis. He called me. Everybody say He called me. Called me on His mercy basis. On His mercy on basis. On His virtue basis. On His virtue on basis. On His goodness. On His goodness. Not on my goodness. Not on my goodness. Amen. What can I tell you? The devil tells you you have not grown up enough. You are not character built enough. You are not holy enough. You are not pure enough. You are not kind enough. You know why? To say what you did is enough. He called us by His glory. Trusting His glory in you. Trusting His character. apostles are mercy legs mercy object our calling is not based on our merit that's why many people with a very character flaws are doing much more than you i have seen mighty miracle ministers living with so many women how do they do it i have seen holy people not even able to heal a headache they know how to use of course misuse the grace given to them here we are waiting i am not worthy i have to grow i have to grow i have to grow you will grow one day that's the devil's trick yes given second peter quick 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 second peter as divine power has given to us all things shout shout yes <clears throat> shout it read it everybody yes his divine power has given to us all things that pertain to life and godliness through the knowledge of him who called us by glory and virtue shout it his divine power his divine power 
His divine power. His divine power has given. Has given. Will be given or has given. Has given. Has his past or future. Past. Past. Has given. How many things he it has given? All. All things include your prophetic office, apostolic office. All things includes your. Holiness for apostolic calling. All things include your energy for the apostolic calling. All things includes your everything you need for the apostolic calling. Through the knowledge of Him who called us by His glory and virtue. What a joy. What He needs, eh? I'm not saying grow perfection, become perfect man and I will use you. He said, focus on your calling. As you keep going into your calling, the energy, the grace, it will be constantly released to overcome huddle after huddles after huddle. Apostles have their own temptation. Prophets have their temptation. Every ministry, God knows, devil knows how to trap. But don't wait. Give your whole attention to find out your calling. Study. Study. Find out your calling. And develop your calling. Keep running into your calling. The grace will flow and every temptation, you will jump over it. Don't wait. Don't wait. Ephesians 4, one quick. I, therefore, the prisoner of the Lord, beseech you to walk worthy of the calling. I am inside the prison. Paul the Apostle is saying, I beseech you, I beg you, I plead with you, I plead with you. Uh, Walk worthy of the calling with which you were called. You were called. called. Shout everybody. I, I was, was already, called. already called. called. On mercy basis or merit basis? Huh? You know why he, you know when he called you? If you ask, after 20 years, when you attain 20th year, if God selected you, nobody would have selected. Before you were formed in your mother's womb. Before you know evil or good. From your mother's womb. Even before your mother's womb. On his pure mercy basis. He stamped the apostolic calling. On your head. That's why I am here. You are here. Only one reason. Before you were formed. God ordained you. Ordination over. Order in Dio. Makatirio shakarabahatara balabara. Shakatara laraba. Makatara laraba. Shakatara balabara. Settle it. Please settle it. Please settle it. The only thing you have to know is you are not waiting for calling. Better know what is your call. Please be seated. Know what is your call. Matthew 13. Matthew 13. From first verse 44. Again, the kingdom of heaven is like a treasure hidden in a field, which a man found and hid. 
and for joy over it he goes and sells all that he has and buys that field everybody say the kingdom of god the kingdom of god the kingdom of heaven the kingdom of heaven meaning all things that comes from the kingdom of heaven your apostolic calling Amen. brings you the kingdom of heaven Amen. through you Amen. to the world Amen. i said the dominion kingdom shall be upon the shoulder shoulders are yes so you know this calling is like a hidden treasure lazy man cannot search and find it you wanted to run for god and somebody gave you a missionary call you surrendered you have your desire to serve but you never found out where is your calling what is your calling what the bible says about your calling you never took time i would say an apostle or a prophet or any believer must spend maximum time in searching the bible about their own calling you say you are an apostle i ask you how many how many hours you spend to know what is this all about you never did that it's a hidden treasure hidden treasure needs deep searching did you understand it have you ever read that have you read about prophets because apostolic includes prophets also how much time you have with the bible you run 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 and wonder why no fruits an apostolic calling demands all life not distraction they said we will not sow tables the early days they were handling money they were handling everything came to the feet thousands came he said ah devil you try to distract me from my higher apostolic calling no devil stop he said we will give see we will give ourselves to prayer and the ministry of the word that's why sometimes the market apostles the company apostles the car owner apostles i don't know where is it in the bible if it is i am happy about it i don't attack i attack <laughs> I feel God's apostles are the closest to Jesus Christ. They give themselves to be with God when God called disciples. The first thing they did that they might be with him. And know his feeling know his smile know his cry among all the calling brothers apostles prophets are the foundation for the church did i make it clear everybody say apostles apostles prophets prophets are the foundation are the foundation upon which the whole building is fitly joined together jesus christ himself being the chief corner stone you know the corner stone 
how many of you know corner stone when you build a building first you find a place one place mark and you put a stone there from there you measure length and width and the whole building yeah the whole building if the corner stone is this side twilter the whole building will be twilter jesus christ is the chief corner stone apostles prophets are the foundation, foundation stone let me ask you you are all apostles i will ask you the whole building is built which is closest to the corner stone roof wall beam everybody say foundation foundation is the closest to the corner stone is the closest to the corner stone apostles apostles prophet prophet number one job number one job is to have fellowship is to have fellowship if you miss here you miss everywhere i'm not speaking this to condemn you can i tell you if you are called it's a package you didn't open that package the love relationship with god prayer is love affair with god prayer is entering the court room our throne room of god and sitting with jesus in the council it's not my word the great faith leader e w kenyon said that relationship you are an apostle but a fellowship husband and wife is a relationship she is my wife he will say he is my husband but they can live in the same roof 10000 miles away from one another inside the heart they will go and by the same bike the college i studied one of my principal always used to bring his wife in the scooter i have never seen him he will leave her in her ladies college and he will come to our college i said wow what a couple what a couple what a couple they were always in the bike after some time the real truth came to me they never talked with each other for more than 10 or 20 years i thought how will they how will they in a bike in the same even if she falls she cannot say hello husband <laughs> it's not they are later you are called as an apostle he is your master you are his servant apostolic servant of god but god says apostle i called you primarily first of all to know me to come closer to me to have love affair with me to give you a time with me i want to open my whole heart and i want to give you the strategy for my church the secret the key of the kingdom of god so that i trust you amen that's why when somebody run 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 in the ministry i keep away i don't run with them i see prophets of passage are the foundation stones nearest to the corner stone and i is it possible it is a package <laughs> when god called you as an apostle He has given you that hunger in you, that desire in you to be with God. I'm not even talking about interceding and praying and begging. No, just this may reach even me. Our kya chahu? Just fellowship. 
build up that broken altar come back holy spirit holy spirit i ask you i ask you who them draw your apostles amen everything that's holding them everything that's holding Every, them everything that's holding them everything that's pulling them everything away everything that pulling them away from your fellowship from your fellowship i break it i break it loose your hold loose your hold let the parcel let our parcels give themselves give themselves to the prayer to the prayer and to the ministry of the word and to the ministry of the word in jesus I, in jesus name shakara kriya tara shera baraba Rabatia raba shekaria tara setra lia raba relia raba la hatra setria tela The kingdom of heaven is like a treasure hidden in a field will you start studying about apostles will you know what is you are hidden in you yes sir no brother will you take time to know what is hidden inside of you can i tell you that's your number one assignment if you are employed in a company you have to know <laughs> what is involved in that assignment job description that's why my book i have foundational book i have written who is an apostle that's a foundation i want you to study it i tell you the more i come to god the more i walk with god for over half a century i have found out many of the things that we are praying begging fasting and waiting will never happen it doesn't come by prayer fasting just by knowing going deeper into the word deeper into the heart of god finding time to know what is expected from me what is the strategy in our schools we take the cell phone for all the three months first we are allowed one month no glory we couldn't penetrate deliverance happen cuts broke again and again they were then one day we realized take the phone when the phones were taken one of the school i still remember they were worshiping worshiping for a long time suddenly gold dust falling many people one young man ran to my room with our parents <laughs> fatima seema grandma see the whole body dust gold dust after that money started multiplying in the money purse i don't know whether you will believe it or you will say it is false teaching <laughs> that's up to you that's up to you <laughs> miracles cannot be explained you and i miracle supernatural bypasses our bible knowledge also from my childhood i never criticized the miracles some miracles i don't understand i keep quiet i study it all happened when we remove the cell phone why not you decide at least 21 days fasting for cell phone i tell you many of you fasted so much and broke your health eat 365 days by take fasting of cell phone your anointing will increase thousand times cut the internet have upper net Amen. you will never be the same Amen. you know what the people will say anna i can live without my wife but 
not without my wifi <laughs> because that is wifi wife high higher than wife how many people spend so much time with wifi the wife is hurt anna we came to hear about apostles <laughs> you are going into everywhere anna i am not an apostle i am a prophet <laughs> why not you decide this 21 days i will read the bible i will study every word apostle i will check my life i will compare my life with the word every day i will pray in tongues whenever they allow me outside shandarabal billa yakla yasmri wa the greatest apostle is paul but he say i am the least of all the apostles who are you paul i am the least of all the apostles he can stop with that you know paul is like me he will always talk contradictory then another time i am not less than any eminent apostles hey paul say one thing pa i am the least of all the apostles very good i shake and i am not less than any eminent so called a pause i say you know i attack no i don't attack i don't i at same style can i tell you it will look like a nice talking honestly i tell you i am prophesying when you have years to hear what the spirit is saying you will know it's not a joke it's god's word for me when you received your calling when in your mother's womb all the miracle working power goes with apostolic calling hallelujah is already back inside you are calling you are too lazy to sit with the open bible i never ran too much but i sat with god too much not too much but at least more than you <laughs> shakatri ola basket toro when you are there in the throne room of heaven because apostles are rulers they are the kings in the spiritual world kingdom dominion is on their shoulder so you sit with the king of kings and king and king of kings you converse you fellowship you hold hand tightly and you exercise rule over all demonic kingdom and you say demon world get out of my country they say yes sir that's the secret of authority i am under authority and when i say go he goes when i say come he come i am under that authority can i tell you if you are only under god's authority everything will be under your authority demons disease sickness curse fear doubt unbelief adultery lust Paki theriya ka gothriya gan Maria ka tharaba kharaba shekheriya tharaba 
Listen, apostles, you can run away from the spirit of adultery. You can run away from the spirit of Jezebel. It's a package. The one who called you has given you enough to fulfill that calling victoriously. Mama, 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 Baba, Maria, Tra, Abla, Hatra, Matera, Bara, Yalla, Karendare, Yolo, Rotor, Maria, Mareke, Barbilia, Rekal, Baro, Baklia, Tra, Labara, Mareke, Raba, Olia, Tereria, Toro, Keketa, Rotera, Tiala, Rabatia, Tara, listen to me, Shake, Apostle. You have so much authority in you. You can shake yourself. Anything that's coming upon you, you can shake. And sit on your throne. If you are an apostle, every enemy that raises against you are under your feet, under your authority. Under your dominion. Though the storms may come and the winds may blow, He will never let go my hand. He will never let go my hand. Though the storms may God and you are holding hands together. Even if you pull your hand, He will not leave your hand. Ishu Muje Chodega Ishu Mera Chodega Bade Ami Yane Se Bade Pana Ishu Mera Listen, apostolic calling, say it. Apostolic calling is, is not a natural walk. Just a natural walk. It's a supernatural calling. It is a supernatural calling. From the day one. From the day one. Till I die. Till I die. My calling. My calling. Makes me. Makes me. Supernatural. Supernatural person. They are the Listen, it's like Jesus the Apostle. wanted to reach the disciples. Heavy storm, waves are high. Jesus thought, now I have to go. 
apostolic calling said come on walk over it he started walking over the water that's apostolic calling all the apostles all the apostles they had the apostolic calling and they said appa i will not come out of the boat they scream ah! i tell you many of you came crying inside screaming inside that's why we ask you to put the suit <laughs> so that nobody sees <laughs> no 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 i really want the apostles to see very dignified and only one apostle had courage hey he is supernatural i joined the supernatural party my company is a miracle company he is a ceo we are his secretaries that to ps he said jesus as you walk can i jesus said peter your character must change <laughs> peter character even became old his character was at plus you know he said lord if you walk i walk why you have power i have power you already shared it He, Jesus said only one word who ever says lord i want to walk over this he will smile come <laughs> immediately you know this fellow he didn't look at himself come come that voice you know he just put it he puts one leg with a shivering it stood then another <laughs> shivering then another when he walked few step the devil thought aha uh -huh. now if we allow this fellow he will not walk on the feet he will walk on the head <laughs> so what he did he increased the volume wave oh! it immediately this fellow would have walked in his calling you know turn this side that side exactly like you did <laughs> till you arrived here <laughs> my dear apostles You know what happened? He looked. Fear came. The faith made him to walk. What he saw brought unbelief. Inside faith, outside unbelief. The unbelief what he saw, what he heard, what he see, what he felt, what he smelled, everything the beauty, everything of this world. crash the supernatural fight immediate thank god he said ah, he was going inside jesus save me he said hey man of unbelief little faith give you a hand give you a hand bade ande ane se bada tu fana na se ish mera hatna chhodi ga ish mera One day the Holy Spirit told me, Ezekiel, now 
is not holding your hand. I said, what? You are his hand. You are his mouth. You are his shoulder. <laughs> Meaning, there, Jesus is walking there, Peter is walking here. Now, one step I take, I take with Jesus. That's the blessing of living in Christ. Christ living in me. I live in Christ. Christ living in me. Apostolic calling is nothing but his shoulder calling. Can I tell you, when a person sink in the water, first leg, last shoulder, don't worry. <laughs> Some people say, Hallelujah. But the apostle must carry everybody on their shoulder and say, you sat on my, sit on my shoulder. We will together walk over the water. That's your calling. That's your anointing. That's your backing. Backing. But I want to tell you good news. I am a prophet. I prophesy. No matter how deep you sank, no matter how much you fell, how much the storm came against you, I want you to know, immediately, the Lord took you out of where you are, brought you here. Now, your supernatural ministry Begin! Begin! Amen! Begin! Begin! In the mighty name of Jesus In Christ! In the mighty name of Nazareth! Nazareth. Let apostolic! Let Let apostolic anointing rise up. Rise up. From wherever you are, rise up. Walk over it. 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 You are God's apostle. Walk over it. You are called a supernatural man. Walk over it! Though the storms may come and the winds may blow, He will never let go my hand. Though the storms may come the winds may blow, For God's called ones, failure is extremely temporary. Failure is temporary. Walking over the water is permanent. Rise up! Rise up! Rise up! Arise! Shine! Your apostolic light has come! Your glory is risen. Malbaraka. Please understand, brothers, 
your number one job is to search your hidden treasure your job assignment the greatness of this apostolic calling study it meditate it will you do that because you are a person who is called to carry the kingdom authority on your shoulder only when you know your authority the nation's power will crumble when you rise up believe me when you rise up you will silence the enemy's roaring the only reason the enemy is sneering at us persecuting us is because not apostles to rise up and execute their authority lift your hand father father raise up raise me up apostles i is apostles raise up raise up apostles apostles all over india all over india all over the world all over the world they have the keys they have the keys of the kingdom of the kingdom whatever they bind whatever they bind is bound on the earth it's bound on the whatever earth whatever they lose whatever they lose is loosed on the earth it's loosed on the earth i as an apostle i as an apostle i shake myself i shake myself from every dust from every dust i rise up i rise up to my apostolic to my apostolic kingdom authority kingdom authority government government is on my shoulders is on my shoulders i cannot be lazy i cannot be lazy i cannot be slack i cannot be slack i give myself i give myself to the prayer to the prayer to the fellowship to the fellowship to the word to the word in jesus name in jesus name i want to Please understand. You woke up now. You are not a sinking apostle. You are a singing apostle. Apostle Paul and Silas when there was so darkness they sang hallelujah that's apostolic package you have it open it though the storms may come winds may blow he will never let go Listen, the kingdom of God is like a hidden treasure. What's your job? Search. How long it will take? Twenty-one <laughs> start, brother. Till you die, you have to explore it. that's your primary goal jesus said if a shepherd loses one sheep he will leave all all he will leave all he will leave all and search he can i tell you i am not preaching i am prophesying 
you are talking about you lost this you lost this you lost days nothing the main thing you lost is you never took time to search you are hidden treasure if you have found that that would have taken care of all did i make it clear did you get that truth inside the bible says matthew i finished now uh, 44 ah uh, he found and hid for joy over it everybody say joy over it. what makes him joyful he found hidden many kilograms of gold hidden pearls so he didn't tell anybody one day the whole world will see now take it first don't go and say hey in my garden under the gold kilogram some people the starting liye they want big advertisement you don't need to advertise you get the gold build the glorious palace get a sophisticated car than not borrowed car then the whole will will say ah in my life i never did advertisement nothing i never went after big people i never asked anybody to invite me i never said i can preach i never said invite me all my life i focused on finding my hidden treasure then people come that's the secret with joy over it. he hide it it's a hidden work nobody knows people like to always be in the prime light they won't be they won't be anywhere when the camera comes they will come here <laughs> i was always hiding when before camera it's a hidden seeking he hide it he said till i fully take it i don't need to tell anybody once when i took the gold and then everybody will know it why should i now tell joy over it he goes and sell all that he has that broken car the broken computer everything he sold it even a small hut he sold it motorbike he sold it hey i have i have decided i have now found out my my only hidden treasure he ran this is what you are calling demands from you 21 days are best days for you to dig deeper 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 in my younger days nobody to teach me all those things in those days what all message i had is what i don't have i am not holy i have no wisdom buddhi ledu prabhu shakti ledu prabhu buddhi nahi hai shakti nahi hai i cried and cried but you know it you are a hidden treasure all heavenly dominion glory power christ is hiding in you waiting for you to search it get it sell everything i promise you once when you find it out everything you sell out will come fresh 1000 times more
it's a spiritual law what you lose you gain what you gain you lose joy over it once when you found out your calling you will not reluctantly give up joyfully give up the whole attitude changes now we preach surrender 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 oh, no. oh, i surrender <laughs> once when you know the hidden treasure i surrender attitude changes you want to give out everything because you found something verse 45 again the kingdom of heaven is like a merchant seeking beautiful pearls seeking everybody say seeking 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 Be- what will you do now seeking seek you may find you may not find see you will find i don't say you didn't seek so far you were seeking something wrong <laughs> your calling is the most beautiful pearl there is nothing comparing to this pearl we will go deeper calling is nothing but god in us working through us that's most precious will you accept that it's beautiful pearl not that lady not that thing not beautiful car beautiful pearl is your car you are calling seeking beautiful pearl next who when he had found one pearl of great price one pearl how many of you say father father my calling my calling is is the only one the only one pearl pearl half half great great price ha ah. and when and went and sold all that he had and bought it amen you think he is a fool you think he is smart fool or smart all that he had your calling demands everything everything your calling demands If you see the apostles life they had nothing to hold they left their family they left everything no apostle died normal death 11 martyred one thrown out to patmos nothing even the boat full of fish that left what happened all the thousands of people silver gold at their feet even then it was at their feet <laughs> not on their head money is nothing to an apostle they never hold anything whatever they had distributor apostles are distributor all to jesus i surrender all 
Father, the word you gave me, I gave it to your apostle. Now you and your word and your apostle. My assignment for this day, I did. You continue your work. Nation needs apostles, Lord. The dark countries need apostles because apostles are not in their calling demons are taking the nations and running Lord rise up apostles take these dear precious apostles they came in search of you leaving everything behind take it as a token of their love and flood in their life Holy Spirit flood in their life like a tsunami capture them Holy Ghost arrest them do a deeper work I give you all that glory in Jesus name